is going to be probably half a mile worth of fence. Uh, I don't know. It, it's a pretty good square. I'll just try to get a measurement or something. You want miles or feet or what? Yeah, it, it, it's two good blocks. I don't know how to describe the blocks, but it's pretty good, pretty good size, sir. Yeah, okay. Yeah, just send me the website. I'll get some uh, uh, ideas what I want and stuff and give you the measurements and see what it costs. All right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You too. Thank you. Yeah, yes, sir. Bye. Oh, oh, sorry, everybody. Welcome back to Farming Simulator 22 here on Western Wilds, your host with not the most, a.k.a. Mr. Blue, Tommy Miller. Folks, how you doing? How you doing? I'm tired. As you can see, it is 102 in the, it's after, after lunch. Uh, I ain't had lunch yet, and uh, uh, Colin Julian's been down here doing his, his thing, and Mr. Yankee and all the others, we got Christina Cole, Ice Damon, uh, uh, just everybody, everybody, all the new ones been down here too. We've been training them how to do stuff. I got some more stuff. Ugh. Nail trap. They got some more stuff piled up. And, um, we don't know what we're going to do with this. Um, I thought about burning it. I'm not for sure. I got to get these trees away from it because they're dead. Uh, well, not dead, dead. Uh, some of them are dead. Some of them got some beetles. So every tree in here is coming down, folks. Uh, yeah, that's right. Every tree there is. Uh, some going to our lumber mill and some are going to be sold because we need the money. Uh, here is January 1st. I got to make a small payment. God, look how dirty this tractor is. Got to make a small payment to the bank uh, before February. So I got a little bit here. Uh, somebody told me I need to go down to the sawmill and check it out. Don't know what they was talking about, so... Yeah, let's get, make sure our hazards are blinking, our strobes are on. Uh, before we hit the road, I'm going to come back around and show y'all what I've been doing, folks. Yeah, well, well what everybody's been doing, I should say. Uh, they're going to lunch. Um, so I'm going to grab some lunch while I'm out, too. I'm going to take this tractor, sell this wood that's on here, because we're going to start loading some... Uh, bigger logs that's over here in this corner and we're gonna go make some money off of them not these things these things gonna go to our thing now those big green ones right there they, whoa, whoa 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 that's where I'm backing kinda back this thing up straight and be alright alright anyway let me uh, hop out of here and show y'all these trees are going to get sold for sure because they're the money makers. These things, nah. Yeah, we get about a thousand, a couple thousand just for that right there. Where these others would be a lot. We got our fuel down here. We got the skid steer down here. I want to show you all that. Uh, they've been picking up all this stuff here. I don't know what this was for. Uh, there was the wooden barn over there and it looked like they was putting up a metal barn which we tore down because so we didn't like it. Um, I don't know if they was going to put metal frame and put this mortar stuff around the edges of it or something. I don't know. All this stuff got left behind. Um, Energy said they'll come out and check on this. Said we might be able to move it somewhere else or something. I really don't know. Got a pole here. Uh, I told him, uh, just let me know. We might end up putting a, a big old shed or something here and might need that or something. I don't know. So they're, they're on their way out, which uh, Kyle and Julian, uh, he's been doing uh, the getting these weeds, uh, not, the bushes. He's been getting the bushes out of here so he can mow. Uh, like he started mowing around as he was getting the bushes up and stuff. We have lots of breaks in this fence and stuff here. 
down through here. We actually took some of the fence out over there. And you know, there's, there's stuff like this. I don't know, really truly don't know what was like straw on the ground. A pig pen maybe? That's the only thing I could think of where this looks. Water trough for it. Um, yeah, I've been looking around and uh, I ain't seen no more of those signs where, you know, hey, you can get rid of this if you cut this sign down. You know, that uh, Mr. Alien Jim put up over in the corner. Hey, as far as I know, there's no more around here. Yeah, I think this might be a, a hog barn area because that's the only thing I know you can get manure in slurry from sheep you don't we already got the sheep this looks like a chicken pen it's pretty good decent shape I don't see no cuts or nothing in it so this must have been put up last I don't see anywhere but this is actual chicken pen you know a legit chicken pen so yeah I don't, I don't know folks but yeah um I ain't seen no magical uh, thing around here it says to sleep but it's been saying that for a while now I've been having some troubles with uh, Ahmad the manual unload for combines and auger wagons and stuff uh, it's been locking my game up and I think a couple days ago or yesterday or something I checked the mod hub and there was an update to it so I got it on now and it's not lagging it's not messing the game up or anything folks so the update helped that now come over here I'm gonna show y'all uh, and you see there's pretty good sized rocks out here a um, couple of the guys thinking that maybe we need to plow everything up start fresh uh, get the rocks out of here, get this as smooth as possible, then come in with the foundation and stuff. And the weeds are really growing back. Man, the weeds are growing back. We still got some sticks and stuff we gotta get up. And you can see where we, uh, yeah, there's, y'all hear that in the background, that's a dog named Bear. He's uh, a heavy drinker on water. But here's our property line for this fence, but we own this all the way over there to, uh, you know, where it uh, starts getting green at. Uh, so I'm going to repair this fence. I'm going to try to see what we can get kind of close to it. But I'm thinking about getting a white fence or something. That way we can keep it painted. But anyway, our goal is to get all these trees out down through here. That's our goal. All the way as far as we can go all around before we have to get in the fields. Uh, one of our tractors is almost out of fuel. It's probably one I left running. Yeah, uh -huh. we're gonna stop over here real quick and get a couple of gallons. Okay, I do have the, yeah, the tractor mod, but it's going for pumps. That didn't hold very much. Filled up pretty quick. Anyway, I'm going to get this over to our log mill. I think I've done enough explaining on this and everything. So, uh, yeah, uh, this, here's the signs I was talking about Mr. Alien Jim does, and I love them, folks. Uh, if you want to take a shortcut in the game, you know, you just, cutting this signpost with a chainsaw will permanently remove all trees from this area. I don't want to do that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get all the trees that I want down and what I want to take to our mill and the ones that I don't want to mess with, I'm going to come over here and cut. I'm going to cut it. But then we're going to be stuck with this sign here because I do not want to remove the power lines, but I want this pole to be out of the ground. So, Mr. Jim, our uh, uh, big daddy. Yeah. When, when y'all, if y'all don't mind, can you explain uh, how I can get rid of this post without getting rid of the power lines? I've tried to go into 
GE, which is Giants, uh, I'm sorry to say General Electric. Nope, it's not General Electric. It's a, uh, uh, yeah, software for uh, Farm Sim. We can go in and edit the map and, and, and the other stuff, you know, like you don't want that hole over there. You can take that pole out or you can take some other stuff out. It, it's neat. Um, it also, it can help you on the trees too. If you don't want to sit there and cut trees all day long, you can just say, uh, chop one down, see what you get for it. Oh, it's going to give me $1,089. Well, you can write down $1,089, then you can go into E and get rid of like 25 trees that you don't want to sit there and cut. And you just delete them. Save it, come back in the game, and add your money in. You know, $1,089 times 25, and just put that in your file. Uh, it's a lot faster, it saves a lot of time for people that record and stuff. I know it's kind of cheating because you're not doing the work but you know a lot of times we don't have time to do the work in order to get a video out to y'all that's where I'm in that buying right now it's, it's been two or three days you know I, I had Friday out but I don't have nothing for Monday yet and here it is Saturday evening and uh, yeah I need yard work to be done and I need a, a lot of stuff to be done and uh, here I am recording for y'all so yeah oh I'd be recording anyway no I'd rather do recording and yard work any day especially when it's hot but anyway folks um yeah I done made it up here ain't I running my mouth well, I wonder why they told me to come up here for hey but one pallet sitting there hmm I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this Ah, over here. Get it where we can see the trailer and the money. Oh yeah, that's right, it's no money. Good, duh. Okay, what it does when I do it here, since I own the place, it gives me the wood goes directly into the sawmill, which is 41,033 liters right now. And we can go up to 100,000. We got 289 planks, and they'll hold 25,000. Which is they'll hold 50,000 of my uh, uh, 1459. But this is how many planks I got now. These are uh, thousand liters, and I got one, two, three, four, five, and this one is number six. So that's six thousand liters of planks I have. And don't worry, these over here are stationary, they're just woods. Don't run in mine. So yeah, I can come over here. And it'll take me directly to the sawmill, sawmill north. And this is what we got, you know, three pieces of trees equals uh, four planks and plus 0 0.15 wood chips. So yeah, I'm not going to do nothing with the wood chips right yet. But uh, I try to keep this pulled out so it don't get filled up. Um, I want to put a furniture store down. And I know we don't have the money for it right now. And plus, I got to pay the bank back too. So I'll probably be selling these bad boys here. Matter of fact, let's check it out real quick. Uh, oh, I did do the uh, contract. Um... Hang on a sec, I'll be right back. Alright, there's going to be a change right here. I don't know if y'all can see it or not, but I'm going to put it in when I get done. But uh, this is the wood supply and transport contract. Uh, it's $29,893. Uh, I, I got that. And um, I'm just saving that. And I'm going to... Um, hang on. There we go. That part's saved. Uh, I'm, I'm on a different screen. I don't even think y'all can see it. Um, but I'm trying to... That what you just saw was for the supply and contract. I'm going to see if I got anything else in there. This right here should be part of the contract. I can't really see it. I'm going to try to zoom in while I'm here. I'm sorry if this don't work out. But 
Uh, this is uh, Billy Bob's place where we was taking it. Yeah, you can see it right there. Supply and transport. I can't see the totals right there, but you can see that. That's what I got for the for the materials. And um, what you saw just a second ago, I'm going to throw it back in real quick. And this is what you saw for the contract. So I got both of them in with that. And also this in here. I don't, I can't remember what that's for. So I'm just going to throw this in. Uh, this is what we got at midnight, the uh, loan and uh, property maintenance and the production costs. So all that there. Yeah, I'm going to throw all that in uh, later. All right. So we're back to our, our regular one. You know, we got barley. We got sunflowers. Uh, we got wheat, 82,000 liters of wheat. We might have that, I don't know. I doubt we beat it in that time frame. But anyway, we got grass, 9,000 liters of grass to the train yard before time expires, $800. That's not too bad, I don't guess. But any, anyway, um, yeah, see our strawberries and stuff, we ain't got very many of those. Matter of fact, we got none on pallets right now, so. Anyway, I don't know why they wanted me to come up here unless it's to remind me to sell that stuff, so. I'm gonna go on back and I'm gonna get some, uh, let's see, what time is it, 17 minutes? Yeah, I'm gonna get a load of good wood in here and, uh, see you then, because it's, uh, it's, uh, it took 40 minutes to do all that, so I'll be back in a second, well, a second for y'all. About an hour or so for me, probably. But anyway, be right back. All right, folks, I got a little done. Uh, oops, wrong way. I'm gonna fly my drone here so y'all can see. Here's the huts, the, the storage sheds and stuff. We was mowing around. Here's where all the wood was. There's where the metal barn or metal frame stud that they was trying to build, like a new barn out of then uh, of course the you know the wooden one was over there with the tractor inside I ain't heard nothing on the tractor yet but uh, the the hard trees I got them laid around over here uh, they probably would be grinding up for wood chips or taken to our sawmill one or the other because there's another pile here and of course you see there's a bunch over here uh, I got most of them here except for here and then it starts around and we got a bunch of them over here, but the good wood is over on this side and around. And we got some here in the middle. Now I'm gonna go ahead and send this baby on up. I want to get a good picture. Um, probably not gonna be too good of a picture, but right in the middle where all the trees are at, around the, the gravel circle drive there, I want a, a pretty good size, huge grain bin there. I, I really do. And maybe on the side of a tractor over there, the right lower side, we could have like a big shop barn or something over on that side. And a couple of little barns around. And we could have that house there. Uh, maybe we can do something with it or demolish that and move Mr. Yankee or Colin Julian uh, uh, or one of uh, the, the new people or the new subscribers. Uh, I'm sorry I don't have your names down and stuff. I need to find some way of printing everybody's name that comments down. Write it down or print it out or something so I can have it and go through it and assign people to different jobs and stuff on here. That would be nice. Uh, Rudeman53, I believe, does that on his live streams. He, uh, the ones that pay him, of course, you know, his paying subscribers, I don't know what they're called, uh, super, super Chat or whatever, ones that does the most Super Chats, I think, which I can't get them yet, but uh, anyway, he lets them drive the tractors and stuff, and I'm, oh, here we go, I'm going to go down a little bit, but uh, I think this is going to be the thumbnail, guys, I really do, I'm going to go ahead and, oh, that didn't go off, did it? HUD visibility is off, so let's see what that does. Yeah, that's a lot better. All right. Uh, thumbnail, thumbnail. Let me get over a little bit. And another thumbnail. Hey, <laughs> hey. Oh, 
one we'll bring that stuff back up but anyway yeah um, some animal pens over there like some chickens stuff like that and maybe some uh, more sheep or pigs or, or something around here you know just different animals and stuff some shops a large grain silo this is in the center of the map and I know it's got an auto save all right as you can see right here yeah we're in the center of this thing right here pretty much and I'm planning to own everything here in the Western wilds because we want to get wild and farm like never farming before <laughs> yeah anyway I'm on uh, F12 oops turn this off turn that back on I'm gonna fall down to this yeah there we go I'm gonna look like I was in the sky don't it all right this baby straps up for one log on top I don't see no straps around yet very top right there so we're gonna be careful and I should have grinded that stump while I was here I don't know if I can go out oh oh hit another stump should be grinding them I think I got them from here on back that way I see an opening. Right, let's turn our hazards on. Might well turn our uh, strobes on too. You know, I have yet messed with the strobe. I was going to put the strobe on back of my chair and get a, a camera going so y'all can see it flashing and stuff when I turn my strobes on. All right, this tractor needs more weight than this thing's loaded. We need to get a semi truck, matter of fact, and save our tractors for work. Okay, the HUD's off. Why is the HUD's off? Here, hang on a second. F12, HUD, visibility on. There we go. And, uh, uh, alright, I'm going to do the time back up here. I usually try to run it 3 to 5. Uh, I turned it down because we was cutting the trees and stuff. It takes a lot of time doing them, so that's why I turn it down. But it's already... It's 10 minutes to 3, folks. 3 p.m. So today's over with. Um, what I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to talk while I'm driving. Go go in here so I can see the road better. But um, we got to pay the bank. We're going to do it today or tomorrow, and we have to pay anything over 50000 or 50000 That's our payment for each month. It's 50000 which ain't bad. I like to pay more. So right now I can pay eighty thousand and and be done with it. But I want to pay a little bit more than that. And I gotta slow down some. That cur that turn's coming up. But yeah, uh, come February, you know, um, I I want to get a uh, furniture store because that's where the money is. Whoa, it's pushing the back end around. Those skinny tires just push all crazy. But, um, yeah, get a furniture store and I want to get some chicken so we can get some eggs. And I want to get another greenhouse. Uh, somebody was telling me about you can do grapes and, uh, uh I don't forgot what they're called. Olives. Grapes and olives. And, uh, yeah. But, yeah, I'm taking the, the, the it's good straight logs up here because it's easier to get down through here. We could come in the other way, but, you know, it's a last little hassle, and pussies make more money. So that's why I'm bringing them down here to get sold instead. My bear, my, the dog is going to town on that squeaky toy. Uh, but, anyway, um, uh, <laughs> We, uh, this makes more money for us and the other ones are, are going for wood planks. But here we go. Uh, $40,300. Hey, there's no environmental score this time around. Hmm. Yeah, I think we were just paid the 50000 and be done with it. And that way we'll have some extra money. We can pay them back come February and stuff. But yeah, you see, I can come through here, but still there's a tight spot here. 
and a little bit down there on these cell phone poles. That's why I don't want to bring nothing big and bulky down through here, like just throwing the trees on there and be done with it. Uh, I don't quite want to do that. Good way to get hurt. But anyway, but yeah, I came in this back way, folks. You got a shack there. I don't really, it's for electric. I don't know, but yeah, I got to see, um, like I said, Big Daddy or Mr. Jim, uh, don't mean to bother y'all. Oh, there's a log there. Uh, change sides, hit B. There we go. And stop loading. Oh. Yeah, stop loading. Okay. Strap it in, and we're going. Um, like I said, I got the fence on order, or I gotta get some measurements and find out what kind I want. We gotta get rid of more of these big trees. And this here, see if we come in this way, we have to swing in wide in order to miss that. So we might have a main exit over there for the grain silos. I think I'm going to get go down through here and get these. That way this be open and then we'll work on the center maybe. I really don't know. But all that's going to be off screen. And uh, folks, I don't know if I'll see y'all in February or not. We're going to go in here. Let's see what's... Uh... Oh, look at that little thing. That'd be neat. 21,000. Ain't too bad. We're going to hold off on that though. Uh, I'm in the wrong one anyway. I need to be in this one. Uh, we're going to go down through here. Uh, as you can see, we're in January. And I'm trying to... Um, why can I not see my mouse? There we go. Here's January. We can't do that. February. March. Uh, if we go here, here's cotton, and here's cotton. We can plant 1st of February or 2nd of February. Around here, we plant cotton April the 15th. April the 15th is the insurance date that they can start planting cotton. So that's, that's, we'll probably plant last of March, maybe. Of course, we have to pick it. In, in November instead of October uh, but I like to get some soybeans I like to get some corn in the ground and um, I'm, or wheat won't be ready till July and August but yeah this stuff like that and as far as our fertilization goes uh, our pH lime is looking like this this area needs to be more lime put on it and this needs a dose of lime put on it and nitrogen is looking good, but I don't know why this and this one is not registering because I've done soil samples. I don't know why. I, I just don't know why it's showing nothing. pH showing, but nitrogen's not. Yield, nothing except our grass field. I guess we'll have to cut it first before we'll see it. And yeah, high, high seed rate up here, so we might put some stuff up here as far as production stuff or something because we need to save our ground like Dagwin's doing save the good areas where uh, we can plant instead of messing them up but anyway folks I'm gonna um, it's about 30 minutes here of recording and uh, I gotta go get my daughter from work and uh, in real life and when I get back I'll probably come back and cut some more trees down I'm just gonna stack these up somewhere out here probably going to get a, a wood chipper or something just chop these into wood chips and see if we got a biogas plant over at our BGA you know we ain't been over there let's go over there can we go here's the uh, gold production we'll visit uh, as you can see we, we're going to need a methane to get that started I saw the fans moving. I'm like, huh? Um, what is this? 
line protection. Oh, so I can put my... Oh, yeah, I gotta pay the bank. Gotta pay the bank before I do anything. Oh, my. Jump over that. So we got a place to put uh, grass, turn it into a sellage so we can sell it down here. Uh, here's the methane place. I don't know if we can buy it or not. We have to have something, uh, a suitable trailer for it. And I gotta get back into seeing how all this here works. Uh, buy building biogas plant for 25,000. Guess we're going to have to buy these things. What's this? Uh, does all this come with it? Maybe it does. There is a digestive area. Yeah, um, also, folks, uh, while I'm fixing to pay the bank back, get over here where it's quiet, I have a problem with the Kubota DLC. All my cards, all my credit cards, or declining uh, my bank card which is a visa debit I put that in as a visa debit and done it and it says directing you to the next page and it says payment failed I've done my chime card which is uh, a visa debit I tried it and uh, I even tried it as a credit it still didn't go through now, I have not tried my cash app. I'm going to try that and uh, see if that does anything. Where's, oh, right here's the bank. All right, I want to pay 50000 back. I got, uh, got 90000 so that'd be forty at 50 So I need, uh, let's see, let me just pay back. Uh, I get it to 550, that'd be 40,000. So, all right, that's 40,000. That's 50,000 right there. I'll tell you what, you know what? I'm paying 90,000 off. We are down to $30,355. Folks, we got a lot of trees that we can cut down and make money off of. Um, so I want to, and there's the sheep. So they're almost at reproductive age, so we'll be getting extra sheep. I'll be watching for that. Um, barley, sunflowers, wheat, and grass. Um, I'm gonna go back up here. Um, grass. We can harvest anytime. So. Yeah, maybe we can. I don't know if we can do that or not. Be something that we probably could try. You know, they're, they're wanting 9,000 liters of grass. That's not too much. I wonder if they take it in a bale form. I don't know. We're going to try to see. That's only $800, though. That's not going to help that. All right. Um, trying to see where that is at. We're going to go down here. That's a thousand liters right there at seven hundred and twelve dollars. So that's a pretty good price for uh, whatever. What was it? Eight? Eight? I can't even remember. <laughs> I can't remember. Uh, but anyway, we going to get right down here real quick. Lettuce. Um. We ain't got no lettuce right yet, but there is some coming off. Uh, January and February is a good time, so whatever we make. And we got some planks. That's the other thing I was going to look at. Uh, planks are going down, way down, 11.43. It's not too bad, but it's, they've been a lot better. I see furniture is like a thousand dollars more folks um, and there's other stuff we can get that we can sell yeah but anyway I've rambled enough uh, plan is do trees off screen I'm gonna try to get that done before I come back might skip February come back in March 
That way we can plant some cotton or something. I don't know. But anyway, I uh, appreciate y'all watching and everything. Folks, I love each and every one of y'all. Thank you for the comments and stuff. The support. The watch time. My watch time's in the green still. Every day my watch time's in the green. So y'all are awesome for doing that. And uh, if y'all can, get me to a thousand. A thousand family members, folks. Um, yeah, that way I can start making money. I can, maybe I can turn this into a career and uh, just make videos for life. That'd be awesome. That way I could throw some vlogs in there too. Yeah. Which is a vlog is coming up. Um, matter of fact, I don't think I have it handy here, but I believe. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, I was explaining to Tactic Gamer. Uh, he put a comment in last time. I think I put it in the last video. Uh, you're a legend of farming similar games, man. Can you farm in real life as well? And I just, I, I, I feel sorry for the brother because I just broke down explaining my life history to him in the comment. You know, I started around about 15 chopping cotton and stuff and I worked all the way up to 2011, uh, not on the farm, uh, year 2000, I think, on the farm, and from 2011, or 2000 to 2011, I was working at Walmart and stuff, so I'm thinking about, if y'all want to see that, if y'all want me to sit down in front of the camera, just me, you, and the camera on me, no game, no nothing, just real life me sitting there talking to y'all. If y'all want to see that, okay, if y'all really, really, I'm talking about really want to see that, I'm trying to do something here, I don't think it's going to work fast enough, um, my likes go from like anywhere from two likes up to, let's see, that is a 12, that's a 5, that's a 10, that's 11, uh, my screen just blinked, 7, so I usually range around about 12 likes, give or take, get me to, oh, see, this one right here, it had 16 views, it had 26 comments, which I know, uh, 15 comments, of y'all commenting is like 30 comments so you know me replying so 15 comments even at 16 views if y'all can get me I'm gonna say 20 likes on this video here get me to 20 likes okay 20 comments 20 likes both of them I will do a set down video once a week doing something first one will be about my life how i uh, was raised up and up to this point and then maybe the next one will be about my likes and dislikes of life and um just so on so on whatever you know i want to start communicating with y'all and actually showing more interest in y'all you know i comment back i like your Y'all like my video and comment and stuff. I like y'all's and comment. We go back and forth as a community doing that and stuff. And it's it's good. It's good for our algorithm and stuff, you know. And it, it's good just to get to know somebody. Well, that's what I want to start doing. I, I know y'all want to see more. Maybe more games. Um... Besides this farming simulator, I know a lot of y'all just want to see farming simulator. That's where I am, you know. But I, I do try to help out and support other people and stuff by watching other part of their videos. Uh, you know, you might have a second channel or something. But I want to start, like, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays is farm sim. Maybe Tuesdays and Thursdays can be vlog time or something. You know, Tuesday is like future me wanting to tell y'all what I want to see in the future and Thursdays could be throwback. Throwback Thursdays or something. No, we're not throwback mountain. Y'all stop that. Uh, but anyway, 
if y'all want to see that get this video to 20 likes if you can't do it on this video get my next video I make or one of my videos in the past to 20 likes as soon as I see around in this area if the past or the future or this video gets 20 likes I'll I'll do the the vlog thing set down vlog and I might even do it live yeah see the sheep say do it live do it live mr. blue go live I just might do that see then so yeah go live go live anyway folks I gotta get off here I love each and every one of y'all and just thank you so much I can't say that enough thank you thank you thank you thank you until next time y'all have a great day a blessed day and I will see y'all in the next episode bye